Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're going to be doing a little bit of a review. Not so much. Um, these products I don't really want to recommend to you guys. Um, but I still want to review them and I still want to do like a lip swatch um, kind of portion video, if you will. So today, let's talk about fake liquid lipsticks. So I have here two fake Kylie lip kits, two fake NYX lingerie liquid lipsticks, and one fake Jeffree Star liquid lipsticks. So I'm just going to swatch these for you guys. Um, I'm going to show you what they look on my lips and everything. They are safe on my lips. I've worn them before. Um, I haven't gotten an allergic reaction for them or anything like that. Um, I don't recommend you guys get them, but if you want to venture out and you want to try out these liquid lipsticks yourself, then uh, by all means, try them out for yourself. Just don't quote me on these things and don't say that I actually said, hey, go out and buy these fake liquid lipsticks and I'm not actually promoting these. So I have here, this one is a um, horrible, horrible dupe for the um, Dolce K. This is supposed to be Dolce K, but it's very much orange. And I don't think it looks good with my complexion or my skin tone. Um, if you've got, if you guys have seen, oh, so, excuse me, um, if you guys have seen my 100 layers of fake Kylie lip kit, then you know that this is the one that I used on my lips. It kind of gave me a little bit of like a rash, a little bit, not that much. The second one I have here is supposed to be Candy K. It looks a little bit like Candy K, I'm not sure. Um, it's a little bit pink. It might be, might be the same color because this one's a little bit fatter than the other which I think is kind of weird do you see that this one is a lot thicker and then this one is like a skinnier tube so this might be like slightly similar to candy K, but I'm not 100% sure and they both smell like kind of like cookies so next up, I have these NYX lingerie liquid lipsticks. Um, the first one is in embellishment, and the other one is in teddy. So this is like a purplish, brownish color. And again, they have that um, smell that tries to cover up the nastiness that they put into these liquid lipsticks. Because you guys don't want to know what they put into these liquid lipsticks. You're putting that shit on your mouth. And then this one is Teddy. It's a brown, very brown nude color. I kind of like it. I wore it to school one day and I got a lot of compliments on it. So, um, they're not all bad. And then the last one I have is this one, the Jeffree Star liquid lipstick. This one is in the color... Oh, it's Dominatrix. I have this in Dominatrix. Sorry, everyone. I'm just like... Uh, my brain is not on right today. This did come a little bit damaged and some of the product came out of the bottle. So I did get a refund for this. But it definitely does not have the same color as Dominatrix. It's supposed to look like... Because it's definitely supposed to be like more of a brown. It is supposed to be a brown, not a red. It's not supposed to be red at all. And do you see this? This is just terrible all the product just fucking came out and the doe foot doesn't even look like a doe foot it's just basically straight i'm very pissed about this one um i bought this one on wish this doesn't have a smell to it or it does have a smell but it's like a nasty smell it's not a good smell i bought this one on wish um i got these nyx lingeries on wish and then i got one kylie lip for kit from Wish and then I have the other one that I bought on eBay. Uh, the one I bought on eBay is um, Candy K and that one's a little bit better. These are all the swatches of the liquid lipsticks. Um, you guys can tell, you can have your own opinions on these. Um, like I said before, I don't recommend these. 
But yeah, I want you guys to be safe and I don't want you guys to get allergic reactions or anything like that. Um, but I am going to swatch them on my lips. Um, let's hope we don't get an allergic reaction because I haven't tried uh, at least one of them. Um, the dominatrix one kind of gives me like an itchy lip, but that's about it. So do not buy these. I don't say buy the real ones because the real ones are kind of expensive. Um, but we're just going to try them out. We're just going to see where this goes. liquid lipsticks that I have collected over the past year or so. Um, like I said before, you guys can try it at your own risk. Do not quote me on anything. Um, these are not 100% safe, so I want you guys to be safe and don't buy them. But if you do, use them at your own risk. Um, if you do get an allergic reaction, just throw it away. Don't, and if you do know that you have allergic reactions to products or to makeup products. Do not buy them at all whatsoever. Do not try them. Do not buy them. Buy the real stuff. Um, if it's too out of your price range, you can buy the fake ones if you want. But like I said, again, don't quote me on anything. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick review video, if you want to call it that. Um, but once again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave me a like down below. Hit that subscribe button. I make a bunch of other videos. If you guys want to see them, I make lip swatch videos as well and review videos. So with that being said, I will talk to you guys soon in my next video. Bye, guys.